Hello YouTube. In this video I'm going to show you one of the easiest, simplest, best solutions for a PDF file creator that is actually free. That's right, I said it. What's up? It's free. It's actually called PDF Creator. And I will post the links in the details so that way you can go download it direct or go check out the site that it exists on and it's going to look kind of funny and doesn't look legit at all by the fact of the name that the site is actually called file hippo <laughs> but it's a legit site if you go to file hippo just in the search bar type in pdf creator and hit enter or click the go button and you'll see it right there pdf forges pdf creator click on that and then up here in the little right hand corner you'll have the download the latest version all 16.99 megabytes of it yeah it's a pretty small program but it's pretty powerful and it works really well there it is save as pdf creator 171 setup save you'll have to tell it to run depending on what browser you're using be it firefox internet explorer or pdf creator hopefully you're not using internet explorer hopefully it's firefox or google chrome and chrome just pops up down here at the bottom click on it and then just hit run and of course the user account control is going to come up just click yes select the language naturally it's going to default to english okay now mine's going to pop up saying that the pdf creator is already installed because it is i might have to uninstall the previous version but it'll go straight to the standard installer once it's done and there it is. Welcome to PDF Creator Setup Wizard. Next. I accept the agreement. Next. Mm. Probably best just to leave it on the install that it sets on because you don't need all the extra language packages and you don't need the extra language help file. So whenever it comes up to the part for the install select components just leave it on whatever it defaults to and hit next and then install okay I don't want the toolbar that it's going to install so I'm going to deselect every one of those if you do want the toolbars you can leave them selected I hate toolbars and I hate them with a passion so I'm going to deselect all of them and hit next okay and then deselect the show help after setup and hit finish now if you have a text document or something like that a document that you're working on something that you need a actual official digital copy of especially like a resume or something like that a lot of them are like please send pdf files or something like that um, a lot of businesses use pdf files you'll find a lot of books and stuff that are in pdf files this is just a really quick easy way to make a pdf file of absolutely anything that you can print what it does is it creates a PDF creator printer and it uses the print function to generate the PDF file so if I go to print and on the destination I'll hit change and select PDF creator you're gonna see right there everything that it's gonna do if I select background colors and images I have it exactly as it looks and then if I hit print, there's PDF Creator. Document title. We're just going to name it Test for now. Hit Save. It'll automatically save it to your documents. There it is, test.pdf, save. You'll see this little bar comes up as it goes through the process of writing the file. And then right after it finishes, it starts up PDF Architect, which is a uh, editor and a viewer and there's our PDF file now to verify the PDF file for you I'm going to close architect go to my documents there's test look at there Adobe Reader there's our PDF file two pages long but it's there 
See, it even gives it page numbers, gives the stamps on where it's from. So yeah, this is a very, very helpful program. It is a very good program. It is a free program. It works absolutely great. I highly recommend it, especially if you do a lot of work with PDF files. This is very, very easy to actually go in and create like a form using uh, Microsoft Office, uh, OpenOffice, LibreOffice to create a, a form that you need and then you can print it or create a PDF file and print it out and the PDF file will always print exactly as it is so if it's a full page file it's going to print a full page when it's printed and it is going to work out extremely well you'll always have a copy of it and you can print it out right there have it signed notarized whatever you need to do this is a really good way for working with like legal documents uh, applications uh, resumes just really anything uh, it's one of the programs that I highly recommend it works extremely well I've been using it for many 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 years and again as I stated it has the absolute best price tag for of free and you know it just it does what it's supposed to it creates PDF files from text documents and other files like I said basically anything that you can print from you can create the PDF file. This information is out there for absolutely everyone. And as always, watch, like, and share. Have a great day.